Hello everyone, my name is Tor and this is Anthropology. Welcome back to um, another video. My name is Tor for those of you who are new. This channel is all about uh, promoting fun ideas around fashion, talking about queer icons, doing luxury reviews. If that is sort of your thing, if you're interested in that, if you're interested in seeing that content, then definitely like this video, comment sort of your favorite part or something that interested you, and subscribe for more content. So in today's video, we will be discussing my Celine Luco loafers. Um, I got these over a year ago, and unfortunately, I haven't had the chance to wear them very much because of, you know, the whole pandemic. So I got these originally uh, as a work shoe. Because of COVID, I've been working from home, so I haven't really had a chance to wear them in an office setting very much. The wear that I have gotten, I really love them. So here's the bottom. They are very worn. Don't judge me. It's gross, I know. Within this video, I'll be talking about the shopping experience, the sizing, the quality, um, and then overall if I recommend them with the price. To start off with the shopping experience, I got these from the Celine Men's Boutique within the Holder Renfrew uh, department store in Vancouver. So I got these February 2020. It was right as I was leaving Burberry, right before I was starting my job as um, a recruiter. And basically I wanted like, you know, an elevated work shoe, something that I could wear within an office setting and look really polished and also something that was fun. I basically, it was my last day at Burberry and I was just walking around. I was creeping on the Celine website a little bit beforehand because I wanted a work shoe and I was really interested in Celine and I saw that they had these and I was like, oh my God, I love these shoes. So then I was like, if I see them, I'm gonna buy them. I was walking around the Celine Men's. I saw that they had just put these out because they had just arrived. And I was like, oh my God, I fucking need those shoes. So I go in, I'm like, hey, what size is that? And they were like, oh, these ones were the display ones. They were like, oh, we just put these out. These are a size 39. I was like, oh my God, can I try them on? So I tried one on and then immediately I was like, put these on hold, I will buy them like once I'm finished work. So basically that was the story. Um, I got the shoes, that was it. So in terms of packaging, they came in a big Celine box. I don't have it anymore. I lost it during the move or I just threw it out, I don't know, and a Celine bag and then the Celine receipt holder. So since I purchased these from Hold Friend Crew, it came with a Hold Friend Crew receipt. So these were originally 920 Canadian and then after tax, they were 1,030 and then 40 cents. Fun story about these, I actually saw them go on sale in the Celine summer sale or winter sale, no. Celine winter sale, they were like $400 and I was like, like of course they would be on sale. Of course the ones that I got would be on sale. But the problem with Vancouver is everyone has small feet like me. So the only sizes that were left were like 44 and like 46. And I was like, that's definitely not gonna fit. So I'm glad I got the ones that I did when I got them. But you know, this shit goes on sale. So just keep that in mind. You don't need to get it right away unless it's something you really want. So now let's discuss the shoes. So. I got these in a size 39. They fit true to size. Um, they don't make this exact one anymore, but they make the all black one. They make the black one with the chain. They make a red one with the chain. They had one that was like leopard print pony hair for a while, which I was really interested in, but they don't make the three tone ones anymore. I think this was just a seasonal release. So for these ones, they are blue in the body, blue polished um, caskin. They have a white sort of toe tongue area. And then this little detail is in a forest green color, which I really, really love. I think it's really nice and unexpected. They look very put together, but they also look very fun and young and casual. So in terms of quality, these are amazing quality shoes. They have an all leather sole and then basically they're 100% leather. So the inside it is suede and then the insole is leather as well. Um, all of the stitching is really thick and from what the salesperson told me, they are hand stitched. So I think that's really nice as well. Um, you will have to get the bottoms changed because they are a leather bottom. Um, just with wear, you'll have to go to a cobbler and get that done. But as of right now, mine are fine. I don't wear them extensively. I barely wear them at all anymore, which is really sad, but I sometimes just break them out while I work from home because you know, I'm never going into an office again, so I might as well just wear my clothes and pretend that I am in an office. 
So essentially the quality is amazing. The craftsmanship is amazing. Obviously they're a very expensive shoe. They're a thousand dollar loafer. Like you would expect such. They have the little triom um, stitching on the back. So this is like a nice way to tell, you know, that they're Celine. They're very understated. They're very just sort of, they sort of speak for themselves. They're not like, look at me, I'm a Celine shoe. They're just like a nice little loafer. And I think they're really, really cute. So they also came in this Celine dust bag. They came in two of them. Um, they're just a classic Celine dust bag, nothing too special. And then would I recommend these shoes? 100%, I would definitely recommend these shoes if you're looking for a really nice casual loafer. I'm going to insert two looks. So how I style them, one more casual, one more dressy, just so you can get an idea of how they look on. Um, and I'll insert some clips on the feet as well. So here we have more of like a casual look, something that I would pair with these, just maybe going out for lunch. I would only really wear them if I just want that more like dressy look. So see, we have the blue matching with the blue, the white toe with the white jacket. This jacket is a pair of jumpers and then we just have Levi's jeans, Burberry top and some McQueen skull socks. So look number one. All right, so here we have look number two. This is a casual look, but it's also a little bit more dressy. Um, I would wear this to the office in Vancouver. You know, Vancouver is a very casual place, maybe casual Friday if you don't have to wear a suit where you are. But here we have some blue dress type pants from Uniqlo, beige sweater, um, a knit from Uniqlo as well. Um, same socks, because you know, why not? They're fun. And the loafers. So we have the blue with the blue. Um, the white with the cream. I think this looks really nice. So that was my video. Thank you for watching. If you are interested in seeing more of this content, please consider subscribing and liking this video as it helps the algorithm. And also check out some of my other Celine content. Um, I really like Celine as a brand and I think it's really having its moment. So definitely stay around and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.